citizen to the school, like basically being doing good stuff when like no one is watching you. I feel like Rep to You is just representing my school and and just being a good example. It's kind of a so a porting little line that we can all um, come together as, and it really brings us unity as a school. To me, it just it means taking pride in your school and being just grateful that you get to go to Union because Union is really one of the best schools in the nation. Oh, well, repping to you, to me, it feels like, or it is, like, going around and, like, helping people. Like, what I do is, like, a kid, today he dropped his papers, and I was going to be late for class, like, if I did help him, but I still chose to help him anyway and just took the tardy. And, like, you could go around and just be responsible, help the kids, like, get their zeros up and stuff like that. Since it does mean rep the U, um, it's more towards union students. And so I think everyone has the opportunity and chance to. And I think that's what we're kind of going for is to get the end goal for everyone to be able to rep the U. I feel like it's the student's job and like the parents to like, I don't know, make us come off in a good way. All union students should rep the U and also like union parents and basically anyone who goes to union. It can be anyone. It could be your grandma, your grandpa, somebody over in Spain. They can, <laughs> I mean, leadership and like repping the U. There's basically those five good characters like respect, responsibility, encouragement, stuff like that. That can go a long way. Like you can go anywhere with that. It's the administrators and faculty, but only that goes so far, and so you need the students too, and it goes both ways, so it can't be just the students and not the faculty, and so it's the whole family union, and it, we all pull, pull the, the ship the same way, you know, and we all try to, we all want to reach the same destination and make the school better. I definitely think it's important that um, whenever we're wearing union shirts or representing union, to rep the U, that's kind of what it all stands for. Um, it allows us to be held accountable and it's kind of like a standard that we set. If they see you acting bad, then they're gonna think everyone in the school or like most people in the school act the same way. If you go out in public acting bad or not acting the right way you're not supposed to be, they're gonna just be like, what school you go to? If I say I go to Union, they're like, oh, well, I'm guessing all Union kids are like that because I could be maybe the only one Union kid they met. I know I rep the U at work because like customers come in and like they see how positive I am. They're like, do you go to Union? I'm like, yes, I do. Just anywhere. At your house, in the school, definitely. On the football field, you know, on the weekends when you're not there because it's something you carry. I mean, it's just like a last name, you know. I would encourage people to join like an activity, to be more involved with the school and that will be a way to rep the U. And so you'll learn how to pick up on stuff, being more respectful and learning about new things. We have high standards. We have great academics, sports, and like just a diverse like campus. So like nobody feels singled out. We have a lot of different programs in Union that help it. Um, for me, I'm super involved with leadership and student council. So for me, it's a main group that is holding you accountable for what you're doing and your actions and your words and um, allowing you to kind of push you to be the best you. Come to the football games. <laughs> the Friday games, you know, it's just something that you want to be a part of. If you need help, ask for it. I promise you that there's students that will come and help you, and especially the teachers and faculty, they'll definitely help you out. And to just, to be, to be open to everything, because we have so much to do, there's, there's a place for every student. But all you have to do is just find it.